Hey everyone, how's it going guys here and we are back in our video and League of Legends What If this morning outdid themselves posting a preview of patch 2.1 which is going to give us a lot of new champions, a lot of cool features, a lot of new skins and events. So we're going to be going over all of them today because it is super exciting and I cannot wait to share it with you guys. Anyways, let's begin. Let's go over what's coming out and enjoy. All right, just one more thing. If you guys take a look at here, you can see the patch release schedule. Version 2.1 is going to be coming out on February 2nd. So in approximately 48 hours, we are going to get the update, which is going to give us all of these new champions, events, and stuff. Of course, all of it is not going to come at once, but they're going to be in the game files and they're going to slowly release them one by one. So it's going to be pretty exciting. If you guys want to see some of this stuff early uh, and stuff like that, make sure to follow my channel. I do a lot of champion videos, skin videos, so make sure to stay tuned for that. But yeah, let's begin. Let's go over these. Coming in February is going to be the spectating system. This was highly requested by the community as... Uh, people wanted to basically do montages people wanted to go ahead and go over their mistakes learn from their gameplay and also be able to watch some of the top players if you guys are new don't know what to do in the game now you're going to be able to go to the leaderboard watch someone or even your friends you're going to be able to just view their matches and see what's going on how they do it in higher ranks and what is taking place and also this was really needed for the esports scene as you guys know while if he's already uh having an esports scene and it's already growing like if you guys take a look in taiwan they actually held their first land so it's super exciting stuff now tournament organizers are gonna have an easier time just getting into a lobby and spectating from their own side instead of having 10 people basically streaming at the same time so they can change like the pov and just go to the person that's playing it was really confusing so now it's gonna be a lot easier and uh, people are gonna be able to spectate and have easier time casting the game and also uh, i was super excited for this future honestly this is going to be super fun you're going to be able to watch people there's going to be a lot of more youtube videos highlighting the top players so it's going to be fun to see where this goes but yeah uh, this is going to be a really good future that is going to be added to the game and i can't really wait for it uh in the next two days Coming in February is also going to be the Lunar Beast event. So basically to celebrate the new Lunar Year, Riot is going to be releasing skins. And so if you guys saw the video previously I posted, you can see that Annie's going to get a skin. Darius is going to skin. So there's going to be a lot of cool skins coming out. I'm not sure about the Fiora and Jarvan uh, skins making the cut. But since this is going to be a Lunar event, I'm pretty sure they're going to also come out as well. So it's going to be pretty exciting to check this out. Our next shared moment will be the futuristic meets traditional Lunar Beast event in February. As a celebration of the Lunar New Year, the squad will be joined by Misfortune in a new skin unique to Wild Rift. We'll keep teaming up with League PC throughout the year as we really don't want any missed opportunities. Also coming in in February is going to be the two lovebirds, Rakan and Zaya. So I'm pretty sure they're going to do like a Valentine event for these guys. It's going to be pretty cool to see them in the game. I'm really excited for Zaya and see how she plays out on the mobile version. Uh, she's going to probably feel pretty smooth since I've played kind of champion similar to her on other MOBA. So I'm pretty excited for that as well. It's going to be super fun to have her added to the marksman roster since I'm an ADC main. But yeah super excited for that it's gonna probably come mid to late february so stay tuned for that i'm gonna have videos uh, doing champion spotlights if you guys want to see those skills and see how they work out so yeah make sure to stay tuned so march is gonna be super exciting as you guys can see we're going to have pantheon added as a champion katarina is also gonna be coming out she was mentioned a while ago she's gonna be super fun on mobile and then we're going to have leona as well added to that roster and next up is going to be none other than Diana. She's going to be coming out as well. And then we're going to have Ramis. Ramis, I'm not sure if he's going to be coming out in March or is pushed back to April, but he's going to be coming out as well since he was confirmed a while ago. Also coming in March is going to be an event called Path of Ascension. I'm pretty sure this has to do something with Leona and Diana and also Pantheon. So we'll have to wait and see. And the next up is going to be brand new skins, the Omega Squad skins. These are going to be super sick. And then also we are going to get the Project skins, which are my favorite skins in League of Legends. So these are going to be awesome when they come out. I'm going to cover them as well. So again... This basically it. This covers the whole blog. If you guys have any questions, make sure to leave it down below. Also have links to all of the articles 
that I show in this video so make sure to go ahead and check them out for yourself if you guys want to read it but you guys thank you all for watching make sure to subscribe and leave a like if you guys enjoyed this video I'm gonna have more videos coming up where I'm gonna keep you guys updated with what's going on with League of Legends Water Rift and also I'm gonna have showcases coming up in the next few days so make sure to stay tuned and I'll see you guys the next time peace out Bitch, I wanna party like Chris.